Three, two, one. Hey guys, so yes, yeah, we're in a bunker in Berlin, and that's our workshop. So there's gonna be uh, there's gonna be noise interfering. But uh, yesterday we read uh, about this uh, case of a specific uh, motor uh, with this specific uh, design, and uh, it was shown that it has two weak points. So we had a spare uh, motor, and we decided to try and break it up uh, to the max we could. And uh, for that we need a strong guy, and that's why Martin's here. <laughs> so, but what we're going to try and do is we're going to try and simulate what uh, happened to, to the user on the forum. And what we noticed it was that he actually had his uh, uh, mounts on uh, using the outer ring. We usually try to, to do it on the inner ring, so this is where we put our uh, bolts and stuff. And um, yeah, right now we're going to try and break it and see how, how much power it requires. Obviously, we don't have any quantifiable measurements, but uh, we, can, we can definitely have a feel for it. Yeah. So, Martin, can you do it? Maybe. Let's see. We'll have it. Go for it. Aha, you're standing up? I have to say, it's a lot of power, and you bent this thing out. So, so what do you what do you reckon? Is the it's quite strong. No, it's but the, the we'd need something stronger for the inside of this thing. Yeah, we bend the the bolt. Okay. So I'm gonna focus a bit. All right, what's our next uh, idea? I actually don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we can actually find some more bolts. Let's try and find some more stuff. Maybe something stronger. Maybe these ones. Uh, so. Maybe these ones are stronger. But how do you feel? Did you go all full power on it? Yep. Okay. So that's a good thing. Yeah, we do want, want to have good motors running. Let's give it another try. What was that? I think it was this one, slippy. Yeah, and it's another one that is bent. Yeah. No, we're just bending the crap out of it. We're just bending the crap out of it. That's a good sign. <laughs> yeah. No, but we need to break it somehow. Or get it to the max. The problem is, I was thinking maybe we can use this crazy motherfucker and then just pull this through and... I'll yeah? Yeah, but then it will, there it will potentially break these ones. So I would still want to see if we can break... This. Yes. This one is strong enough. What's up? Ah, oh, it might. We did it. But the interesting thing is these two points. Yeah. But that was a lot of power. Yeah. And that from a direction... Uh, that wouldn't have been normal. No. But... Wow, I can't even bend it back. Done! Done! <laughs> so we broke it. Yeah. But it was a lot of force. And it was from the side and from the underneath. Yeah. And this wouldn't happen... Do you reckon this would happen on the on the mount? No. It's too much force and from this angle? Yeah. Okay, so we have one more. It would go this way. So it's rotated. It's angle yeah. under an angle. What if you try to screw it more in? I so like that yeah? Before, yeah. It seemed uh, yeah, actually you did halfway through. Hmm. But yeah, guys, we did manage to actually uh, break one. 
So it's definitely something can be improved about the design. But it wasn't really an easy task. With a hammer? Yeah. Let's try. But try try to do it uh, like gradually. First a small kick. It's bending. Yeah. Uh, let me focus a sec. I think I focused. Yeah. Yeah, it's bending a bit. There goes the drill. Bye bye. Bye. That was strong. Do you think we can still pull that thing out? I think so. Yep. Yep. So it can take a lot of force. And there's yeah. just this specific angle that is actually. Maybe we should try the different angle. Like this. And then. Actually, with a bended one? No. Ah, you want to... You can put the force on it. Yeah. yeah, okay. This is the direction... The motor turn. turns. Yeah. Let's try to hold it. Yeah. So, go linear. Try small. It's hard to hold. Do we see it bending or something? At least something? The bolt is bending. The bolt is bending, but this thing is not really. Is it? No. Okay. We need something stronger than a bolt. <laughs> I don't think we have anything stronger to do. I have to say, if it can take these kind of shocks under these angles, it seems to be quite strong. Yeah, it but, won't uh, break that easy. Yeah, but there is, the fact is that indeed here it did break when you we we pulled it out, sort of, right? Yeah. Because this is what we did. We put the stuff through. Yeah, underneath it. Yeah. This way. So, so that, that way makes it sense. Will break. And the That's first point that broke that actually, and the first point that broke was here. Yeah. Where it started bending. So the actual uh, weak point for me would be this. Yeah, but it's not intended in that way. Because so. this one is quite thick, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you want to break the second one like that? Well, I'm afraid the fucking uh, screwdriver will snap. Actually, we should have tried maybe to save the sensors or something like that. Bye-bye.
Oh my god. Yeah, so it's here. Again, we had a small breakage.